Okay, so today I want to offer some reflections about what is trauma. I want to draw upon the work of Gabor Mate and Peter Levine and also a little bit of Bessel van der Kolk in his book, The Body Keeps the Score. Okay. So a change of venue today. I am yeah, just wanting to offer some reflections about what is trauma. So I'm just going to draw upon a few definitions. First one from Gabor Mate. He says, trauma is any experience that's too much for us to process, digest, and integrate. And he also says, trauma is not so much what happens to us, but what happens inside us. And there is a, a story that Bessel van der Kolk talks about in his book, The Body Keeps the Score. He talks about these children who are kidnapped and they go through a, a very traumatic experience. And afterwards, the psychiatrists look at them and they say only one of them has experienced PTSD. And actually, they start to follow up over the coming months. They realize actually all of them have PTSD apart from one. And the one who hasn't got PTSD is basically how he interpreted the experience um, and so I think that's really important for us so we might be in a car accident um, but our experience might be very different to the person sat next to us so you know in my work you know some people are traumatized in childhood some are not by the same event um, Peter Levine he says perhaps the most important thing that I've learned about trauma is that people, especially children, can be overwhelmed by what we usually think of as common everyday events. So it might be, you know, again, Gabor Mate talks about the big T trauma, small T trauma. Big T trauma is the death of someone, child abuse, um, some form of, you know, big event which happens, earthquake, that's a big T trauma. And then the little t trauma is more you know something which happens any experience that's too much for us to process digest and integrate it might be um i don't know yeah car accident so something like that um that's more of a big t trauma um but a big argument something like that or a, a breakup so that's be something like a, a small t trauma so I think this is important to understand. Um, it's also important to see that, you know, Peter Levine goes on to say, he says, you know, while the effects of trauma might not be fully conscious, they are certainly fully active. He says in an insidious way, trauma contributes to the drives and motives of our behavior. What this means is the man who was hit as a child will feel compelled to hit as an adult. So it's almost like an event happens and if we don't deal with it, bring it to consciousness, whether through mindfulness, through therapy, through some form of acknowledgement, it will then drive our lives later on, which is why I'm very passionate about the area I work with a lot, boarding school, because how would it be if we had been held captive if we had been abandoned, we'd bereaved, but we weren't allowed to process this. How might that show up in adulthood? And often it does. So, um, yeah, just some reflections there um, about what trauma is. Again, coming back, Gabor Mate, perhaps the most important thing I've learned about trauma is that people, um, especially children can be overwhelmed by what we usually think of as common everyday events. That's Peter Levine and Gabor Mate is trauma is any experience that's too much for us to process, digest and integrate. So I hope that's been useful. Um, this Friday I'm heading to London to do some filming, um, to interview four people, uh, two from my old boarding school and one psychologist, leading UK psychologist and another leading lawyer, Dino Nocivelli, who I interviewed on my uh, podcast earlier on this year. And then uh, on Friday, I have uh, an interview with Richard Grannon, who is one of the leading voices on narcissism. Uh, that's going to be going live 
he has had he's an author um, and, and, and is very popular on YouTube so he's also an ex-boarder so it should be an interesting conversation it was so uh, you'll learn about his experiences what narcissism is codependency and how that links in to um, people in the world so enjoy okay take care